Hello everyone, welcome to automation community. Today in this video, we are going to discuss an example in which we will be using timers. So let's look at the example first. Example 28. When switch 1 is on, lamp 1 will be on for 10 seconds, lamp 2 will be on after 10 seconds. That means when switch 1 is turned on, Firstly, the lamp will turn on for 10 seconds and after 10 seconds, lamp 2 will turn on. So, for this example, we will use a normally open contact for switch and we will use timers like pulse timer and on delay timer. Pulse timer will be used for lamp 1 and on delay timer will be used for lamp 2. So, let's move to TI portal where we will draw a ladder logic for this example. So this is the interface of TI portal. Firstly, let's go to PLC tags table, PLC tags and default tag table. So here we need to add inputs and outputs. So we have one input, let's say switch one. And we have two outputs that is lamp one. And since it is an output so its address will start with q 0.0, .0. and then we have another output that is lamp 2 and its address will be q 0.1 so then i will go to program blocks and then main ob1 so here we will draw the ladder logic So firstly, I will insert a normally open contact here and it will be switch 1. And then I will insert a coil for lamp 1. So I will select from the list as lamp 1. As lamp 1 should remain on for 10 seconds. So for that, we will use a timer that is pulse timer. For that, I will go to here. And then select from timer operations. Here we have TP. So I will double click here and then OK. So this timer will be TP and I will set the, uh, the pulse timer to 10 seconds. 10. 10 seconds. And then for lamp 2, I will open the branch here. And here I will insert a coil for lamp 2. So I will select lamp 2 here. And then this lamp 2 should turn on after 10 seconds. So we will use another timer, but it will be on delay timer that is T on. And I will click on OK. So I will set the preset ti uh, timer, pulse timer to. 10 second and then here as you can see when switch 1 is pressed lamp 1 will turn on for 10 second and after 10 second lamp 2 will turn on so I will start simulation here Click on load and then finish. And after that, let's start the CPU. And after that, let's start monitoring. And then I will switch to project view here. Let's create a new project.
go to simulation tables and simulation table 1 and then I will click here right click here and load project tax so here we have switch 1 lamp 1 and lamp 2 so when I turn on switch 1 When I turn on switch 1, this lamp 1 gets on for 10 seconds and this lamp 2 will not turn on. It will wait and after 10 seconds, this lamp 2 turns on and it will remain on. So, when I turn it off, lamp 2 gets off. So, when I turn on switch 1, this lamp 1 will remain on. For 10 seconds 5 6 7 and this lamp 2 will wait and after 10 seconds it will turn off and this lamp 2 will turn on it was all about this timer example thank you for watching